My name is Nitika Chopra, and I'm a talk show host, a self-love expert, and I'm also a chronic illness advocate. I was diagnosed with psoriasis at the age of 10, so it's been 27 years now, and I have been dealing with my health through that condition and also psoriatic arthritis for a very long time. It's been a huge part of my journey and my story and why I do everything that I do. A couple of years ago, I called a friend of mine who's a health coach and I was like, so I have this thing, like I feel like there's gotta be a natural remedy for this, but I don't really know what it is. And she said, like obviously diet is like the biggest thing, but in the meantime, you can put coconut oil on it. And I put coconut oil on it and the next day it was almost completely gone. And I just had this like deep message. If you don't go back to what you know is true about how powerful your body is, you're not going to be a around much longer. And I know that sounds like really dramatic, but the medication that I'm on is really intense. And it just became really clear to me that like I was leaning on it too much. I went to the Bloom Center, um, which is in Rye, New York, and they did the gut test, they did hormone tests, they did blood tests, they did all these different things. And I found out some insane stuff about my gut out of one to 100%, let's say, of like 100% is a totally healthy gut. I was at like a three. And you know, you're apparently supposed to have like 30 different bacteria and small amounts of each bacteria in your gut. And your immune system is, you know, 90% of it is in your gut, so it's all connected. And I had five different bacteria and large amounts of each. So I was just totally out of whack. And I started to really just attack this with food. And now, although I still have to take medication, I can't, I can't walk without it, I am so much healthier than I have ever been. I have no symptoms on the medication, which has never happened to me before. And I'm on a path to seeing how can I reduce my medication and hopefully one day get off of it. I think it's possible, but I'm I'm like grateful and proud to be on the journey of that and I feel like I'm strong enough to ask the questions and meet the people and take the tests and even now, you know, as I'm doing much better and I'm in remission with everything, I made a commitment to myself to get retested for everything once a year on my birthday and I'm just like even if everything seems fine, it's like that's how I end up you know, all of a sudden there's like 20 different symptoms and I'm really not doing well and I have to start over and it's like not okay. Um, versus just being on top of it and managing it myself and also being on top of my diet and cooking and being consistent with all of that.